<laughs> I love Jazz Oasis. Who knew? Bring me back here. What is this? 10 years now? 20, is that 20 years ago? Yeah, my daughter's 22. Yes, I love Jazz Oasis. And who knew 22 years or 20 years ago, you know, that we'd be sitting here talking about it like it's the cotton club and stuff. It was our cotton club it brought us out here. It introduced me to jazz when I was coming from R&B, which you know is difficult. Jazz people do not accept you from R&B. They're like, <laughs> just with jazz. So <laughs> it was a big thing <laughs> to be accepted in the jazz world. My first stuff was jazz, but they didn't know that. See, when I got introduced, it was Come Share My Love. But before Come Share My Love, it was David Oliver I'm singing on. It was Billy Cobham, What Is Your Fantasy? I did the lead vocals on. I did Roy Ayers, Let Me Kiss You On Your Poo Poo La La. I was uh, the jazz vocalist. Going all these people, working. Stanley Turrentine. I mean, I did jazz, but I did real jazz, like from the older guys. And so when it came to Alex Young and, you know, Najee's and people like that, I was Mickey Howard from R&B and very difficult. They just didn't respect you, so you had to go over there and just, just be like, boy, I'm about to lay you down. <laughs> Years ago, uh, we did a jazz tour. Um, John Lucian, Alex Young, Mickey Howard, um, one more person. Warren Hill. Warren Hill. <laughs> I, had, I had a daughter, she was about two or three years old, and I, and I, had, I had her on the bus. And Warren Hill insisted on bringing his whoever girlfriend at that time. I'll never forget this, it's so bad. And I was working so hard, because when you're working with jazz musicians, they don't really give the vocalist uh, what you need. And in terms of sound, no sound engineer, because they just walk up and blow, da da da, whatever, they carry little things on the side, when to plug it in, they got amplification. Well, consequently, I'm playing with, you know, um, stellar musicians, and every one of them is a star. So, I can't get nobody turned down. It's like, da 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 da, 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 da the whole show. So, by the time we get to the, you know, third or fourth night, or each week, I have no voice, none. So. I, I can't do air conditioning and it's on the tour bus, so Warren Hill insists on having his girlfriend and she's hot. She has nothing to do with the tour, nothing to do with anything. She's just his girlfriend, his woman on my bus. So we turn off the air at night and I go to sleep. You know, we don't do the air. I wake up, the air is blasting. Shh. I can't even speak. I'm like, and so she goes, you know, I turn the air on. I told Warren, you know, you guys got to get off my bus. She got to go. Everybody got to get off my bus. I asked you not to do this, and now, you know, I've got to pay, you know, the musicians and everything, regardless of what happens. If I sing or not sing, the promoter, everybody's mad at me. I, you get on the other bus. Get on the bus with the, the other guys or whatever. Oh, no, she got, like, you know, belligerent with me and whatever and on, on my bus, and Warren, Takes my two-year-old daughter, like, you know, picked her up like a sag of potatoes and slams her on the bench, like, you know, next to him. And I proceeded to beat his natural ass. When I tell you I whooped that man's ass, it didn't make no sense. It didn't make sense. I snatched that man and threw him off the bus, jumped on top of his chest, tried to, I tried to choke him. <laughs> I was like, you never touch my daughter. Ah! And I'm just mad and irate because just crazy. And he probably never forgave me. But Warren, I bet you don't even know who that lady is anymore. <laughs> it's like, but we had a big, ooh, it was terrible. And then uh, Asians called and they were just like, Mickey, why did you do that? Why did she just, so he had to rent a car and drive behind the bus. That was that tour. And it was also uh, the time when I'm trying to leave my, my uh, abusive spouse who had lost his mind following the bus everywhere. Um, uh, Alex B. Young is sleeping under, uh, at my bunk with a gun. He's like, I'm, I got it. You, got, you know, it's like, I didn't know I couldn't leave the tour because I was a headliner. <laughs> I'm Mickey Howard and I rock jazz. I should have said